Developing for PSVR is a completely new challenge and that is because it is breaking new ground. We are in uncharted waters here and it's very, very exciting to be part of this. When we sat down to like design the rules of rigs, we definitely looked at existing sports like basketball, uh, American football, and obviously normal FPS gameplay. And it was really like how we could fuse those rules together to create something that was unique and exciting, but still felt like a sport. So we came up with a, a mechanism by which we could play a sport in a first-person shooter in a cockpit by creating these kind of mechs, these exoskeletons that, that went round you. Because our game's quite fast and you're in these large mechs, you can actually cover quite a lot of ground very quickly. So it's, it's not as though you could just play on a football pitch. Our arenas have to be far larger. Each of the arenas is kind of designed to give a different feel, like some are really compact, some are very much layered for, with a lot of verticality, because we know that people are actually going to be able to look around. The sound designers, we can really put you in that experience, in that game, in that rig. So unlike conventional games where you have that flat experience just coming out your speakers, with VR, we really have that extra dimension to play with now. You have to build from the ground up with VR in mind. You can't just take an existing concept and expect it to work uh, in, in a VR scape. So when an opponent takes you down in the game, you're basically ejected out of your rig and the sensation of being ejected up in VR and then rushing across the arena was so exhilarating. That was like a wow moment. PlayStation VR is, is bringing something very, very, very unique into the gaming market right now. There's no words that I can use to actually describe what it feels like to be in one of these VR experiences. You really do just have to put the headset on and try it yourself to believe it. Station.